morning. Today I want to talk to you about mirror therapy. Ooh, what is mirror therapy? Well, mirror therapy is you look at the mirror, you are in front of a mirror, you look at your own eyes, deeply, deeply on your eyes, and you tell you beautiful things. The most important thing to tell to yourself, dear me, is I love you as you are in the mirror. Why is so important the mirror therapy? The mirror therapy is very important because anytime that you are working on the city, you will find that there is loads of reflections. And you can see yourself in many, 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 many windows from the shops. Especially when you are in London or in big cities like Tokyo or any city. Whenever you found that your own reflection in the mirror or in the window glass or anywhere where you're working on the train, wow, well, the window of the train I can see myself. Just tell yourself, I love you. Look for your own eyes and look and say, I love you. There could be two reactions that happen when you do that. When you do that, the, one of the first reactions that happens is that you feel really, really terrible. <gasps> Why do you feel terrible? Because you've broken the spell. At the moment that you've broken the spell, that you tell to your own heart, I love you, tears drop. It's very important because uh, we are not accustomed to tell ourselves, I love you. We are not accustomed to uh, be aware of ourselves in a sense of love. <clears throat> Therefore, you will find that uh, to be able to tell yourself, I love you, you look beautiful today, I, you are wonderful, look, your hair is so nice, wow, oh, your skin is such a beautiful color, is a shift. Because the, the most common thing that we tend to say when we see a reflection of us, especially on the window of the shops, is, oh, what a pale face do I look? No. What color you want to look? The mirror, the windows have a special color. It's not you, it's the windows. Or you see uh, why the shape. You found yourself, oh, I'm fat. Not really. <laughs> The windows tend to have a curvature, and if you look at some of the some of the wind, I, I found that uh, whenever I try things on the mirrors of the shops, in some countries you always will look fat, and in some countries you always will look thin. The mirrors have a curvature, and therefore they make you look thinner or wider, depending where you look at. Very tricky, then. Eh? really really tricky why they cannot put a straight mirror you know there is a lot of uh, fun fairs uh, that they have a mirror place where they really have curved mirrors to make you long or curved mirrors to make you wide these ones are exaggerations but in the shops they tend to be the same thing therefore just do not believe much the mirror just believe what you feel and the first reaction that you will find when you do the, the mirror therapy is, here you are, okay. The mirror therapy, I'm doing mirror therapy, you see. <laughs> okay, the first thing that you will find when you do the mirror therapy is that your energy change. One way to, to tackle it, one way to trace if you're doing it and you're doing it good, obviously it's don't tell nobody that you're doing it, and therefore, uh, just keep doing it and uh, looking at the mirror, looking at your reflection. Hey, you look great, thank you. I love you. Hey, you look great, thank you, I love you. And uh, I like your hair. Wow, the hair, those, without doing anything, look how great. It's wonderful, look. Oh, how beautiful eyebrows. Oh, how beautiful cheeks. When you do this, when you appreciate your own beauty, you become how do you track it? You will find that you're walking on a quiet street, two paths, you're walking on the quiet, speed, uh, quiet street, and you have this energy of 
I love myself. All of a sudden, when you start creating this energy of I love myself and yourself knows you love him, love her, you will find that your energy changes. You become clear and brighter energy. More than anything, you will become very, very, very sweet, smooth energy. And this sweet, smooth energy is able to be seen by all the hearts. Only the heart can see this energy. Now, other hearts might be happy, other hearts might be sad, other hearts might be in love or not in love necessarily. But any other heart around you can see your own heart energy. When your heart energy is of love, of I love your heart, I love yourself, the other hearts in a close distance will see you. It's amazing. I, you will find that uh, uh, people walking on the other side of the road or when you are in those large pavements on the city, people cross going down. People turn and look at you. And you think, hey, what are you looking at? He's looking at the beauty of your heart. He's looking at the beautiful energy of love. Love energy is the most important energy in the universe. It's the creative energy of the universe. And when you acknowledge that love for the self, it's magic. Absolutely magic. And then you will find you crossing with people with similar energies than you. You love yourself, people love themselves, then you will cross with, the, cross with those people. You will find that when, for example, don't you realize when you have a bad day? Yes, you have a bad day. And uh, the day gets worse as you become worse of <clears throat> what a day. But there is a change like this. How? It's okay. Brace that. I love your heart. It's okay. Don't worry. It's okay. We're going to do it. Let's do it together. Let's do it easy. Let's go next. Let's be relaxed. Oh, let's just start again. It's okay. It's just one of those things. Relief, release, and restart. Therefore, the day shift your energy starts again. I love you. I love you. It's okay. Everything will be fine. You are not alone. We are together. The day starts again. So, dear heart. Therapy, very, very, very important, and from there you can achieve anything else. Thank you for listening. Eyes.